outside, but the heat is still well and truly on the property market. In fact, the competition at auctions at the moment is so strong that we're seeing more cases of the hammer falling to a buyer who has only seen the property for the first time on the day of the auction. It has a lot to do with the economy, and in this special budget edition of the Kay and Burton Report, we speak to National Australia Bank Chief Economist Alan Oster. But first to the market report and the highest auction clearance rates in five years. It's all about timing when it comes to buying and selling. And according to Domain Group senior economist Dr Andrew Wilson, with interest rates cut this month to 2%, now is as good a time as ever. There's a lot of buying and selling decisions being brought forward to take advantage of the confidence and the enthusiasm in the marketplace. Um, plenty of momentum, lower interest rates, improve affordability, and those aspirational mid-price and upper-price buyers, particularly in the eastern suburbs, very, very active at the moment. And those auction clearance rates really are quite spectacular at the moment, over 80%. You know, through April into May, we have seen a very strong auction market. I don't think the market's overheated, but I think it is strong right across the board, right from the first home buyers right through to the very high end of the market. On the back of those results, it's no surprise that the residential property index has made a sharp turn upwards. The residential property index for the first quarter, which was released in April, has come out at 21, a positive 21 against a positive 12 result um, in the fourth quarter last year. So that's a great turnaround and um, it's now sitting comfortably above the long term average of plus 14. So there's good uh, momentum uh, in the residential property index. Foreign buyers currently account for 20% of purchases in the new home market. However, over the next few weeks, this figure could rise as overseas investors avoid a new tax set to kick in on July 1. We have noticed that there is increased level of interest and concern to this new regulation, but it's only going to accelerate and motivate them to make their decision. Well, the 3% tax, we do think that is probably going to affect the lower end of the market, which is more of your under 1 million market price. It won't affect the top end of the market. Looking ahead to winter, our experts agree it's still a good time to sell. I think we've got so much momentum moving into winter that we will see one of the best winter markets we've ever seen. Our confidence keeps rolling along and that lower interest rate environment now uh, is certainly a positive for that. So look forward to a strong winter market I believe this year in Melbourne.